Hey guys, what's up? Overloaded, back. Uh, I'm a little late on this video, but I wanted to make sure I got everything uh, understood and worked out. Because apparently there were some issues. So, uh, this is going to be my quick uh, workshop tutorial video. If you don't know what it is, then you need to go video searching because it's been out for a while. So anyway, when you upgrade to 1.09F, uh, it will ask you if you want to upgrade your spawn when you launch the game. You can go ahead and hit yes, and this is what your new spawn will look like. It will reset your spawn, so if you've got any griefing damage like I had, it will rebuild it for you, which was nice. So mine looked like crap. The workshop itself is about halfway down the length of the tower. So I've got mine down here. And a quick note, uh, when you are building in here, the block that you're building will uh, locate itself relative to where you're facing. And what I mean by that is, when I come in, I'm facing this way in the workshop. So the block is going to be facing me when I start to build it. Like, for example, this cash register, it's facing me when I started building this. So when I put it down, it's going to be facing me. No matter where I put it, oh, hold on. it will always face me. So keep that in mind. Uh, that's why I only opened up one part, one uh, entrance way into the workshop, so that there's only ever one way in. And it also has these blocks, as opposed to all the others which have the wood blocks. Although if I were to open a path, they would have these as well. So, uh, quick, uh, let's see, cover some things. Um, uh, it's an eight by eight by eight cube which whatever you build in here full size will take up a one block space in the game uh, let's see what else to cover um, if you do use dynamite inside of here uh, for right now what you can do although this will be fixed in the patch the workshop will be invincible to dynamite which is nice what you can do for now is destroy all of these wood blocks here. All of this wood that you see everywhere inside the workshop, all of it destroyed. When you launch your game the next time, the game will recognize that you no longer have a workshop and will ask you if you want to upgrade your spawn. You say yes, and it will rebuild it for you, all brand new. Uh, and one more thing. I see a lot of people asking about how many blocks you can have. You can have 64 total. And what it does here is once you take up all eight spaces here with a custom block, it will automatically open up a new selection wheel here, a sub-menu, for you to choose from. So as soon as you've done all eight, like uh, this was my last one, I'll just show you guys that. This is, I was just using this for demonstration earlier. As soon as you do that, it will open up a new selection wheel for you. So, that's pretty much everything I wanted to cover. I feel like I'm forgetting something. Um, 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 um. Oh, uh, real quick too. Uh, we'll just build something real fast. Saving it into that slot. You can either do one of two things. As soon as you leave the workshop, it will be saved. Or another thing you can do is just load up another uh, save spot and it will save it automatically then as well, whatever creation you have created. So let's go take a quick little tour. Uh, also, quick note, things like lamps and torches currently do not work in the workshop. So if you want to build like a little miniature uh, lamp post or something akin to that the lights will not show up in the final product so here's my fully furnished McDonald's Got my menus cash registers drink fountains tables salt and pepper shakers here's my, my bathroom in here just a few little things that I did real quick so that's about it for now. Uh, if you've got any questions or if I've forgotten to mention anything, please leave a note in the comments and uh, I'll give it a thumbs up so that everybody can see.
Uh, that's it for this video. Stay tuned for my hunt mode and my spleef mode uh, quick rundowns. I'm going to be doing those after the 1.99 patch most likely. It should pass I would say by Monday or Tuesday. It'll be going in tomorrow. Today's Wednesday. So stay tuned for that.